Let's bring in John Dickerson, the moderator of Face the Nation. John, Donald Trump is controlling the debate for the moment, but how long is this moment likely to last? Well, we've seen candidates have hot summers before, where they rise during this period where voters are shopping around, not making strong commitments. Still seven months away until the first votes are cast in the Republican contest. So the real test for Donald Trump is if he can start to feel like a viable candidate as people look at the candidates as they might be actually president. And that will start either in the debates in August or after Labor Day, uh, as voters really start to assess what it would be like to actually live with this candidate as a president. You mentioned this seven months till the votes are actually started to be taken. What can we see about the long-term strategy of other Republican candidates based on the way they react to Donald Trump now? Well, most of the Republican candidates have tried to distance themselves from Donald Trump and his comments, particularly about Mexican immigrants. Uh, all the Republican Party is concerned with trying to find a way to increase the Hispanic vote. And so those candidates, by distancing themselves, are doing the least they have to do to maintain their viability with that portion of the electorate. But that's not enough. They can, they can say what they don't agree with, but the real task for Republican candidates is to show Hispanic voters what they do agree with. And that's what they'll have to do before the voting starts. The question is the difference between what's necessary and what's sufficient. John Dickerson, right. thank you so much. And tomorrow on Face the Nation, John's guests include House Speaker John Boehner and Democratic presidential candidate Senator Bernie Sanders.